done a great job these last 25 games of just being patient and getting what they want every time down the floor, just like that. And as long as they continue to do that, success will follow. Six of the Cavs' ten points have come off of Philadelphia miscues here in the early going. And Mitchell explodes to the basket. He'll go to Allen, and Allen thunders it home. Oh, man, that was a nasty dunk. It was still a 76er at the beginning of this season. I can't keep up. I try. It, just, it amazes me sometimes. I look up. Oh, wow. There's a little Robin Lopez hook shot there. <laughs> I love it. Just out 36 assists wow. on 48 field goals. And meanwhile, here's Levert. He'll cart it toward the basket. Deal to Allen, and Allen lays it in as Levert continues to distribute here in quarter number To see where the next play is going to happen. You just got to be reactive and move. Oubre was caught at by Levert. Levert made him go right, which Oubre does not want to do as Garland at the other end. He banks and scores. Niang took a whack at that ball. And Here's Garland, 44-38 is the sixer lead. Garland shuffles his way into a 15-footer. That's his strong side. You got to know which, where's a guy's strong hand. Force him away from it if you can. Garland picked up by Reed on the switch. Fires a three and nails it. Oh, nice job up there if he can make those shots. 30 of the Sixers, 52 points have come in that lane as Mitchell dumps off to Allen. Allen floats it up and floats it in as... <laughs> Bamba got cemented to the lane after a pump fake. The Cavs just got to continue, though. The perseverance of this Cavaliers team is what's been remarkable these last 25 games. It's there. It'll come. Garland finds Mitchell. Great bounce pass through to Allen. Boy, he threaded the needle, did Donovan, and Allen did the rest. Fades away. It's tough to get to. That's why he's an all-star. Maxie has a dozen points. There's Allen again. This time he takes a shovel pass from Struess. Allen has 12 points. Works his way halfway down the lane, puts it up, missed the shot. Allen gets there. He had it knocked away for a moment by a Buddy Heel, but he recollects Garland's wide open. Well, we needed that. Nice job by Jared Allen staying active. Heel works baseline, finds Martin, who cuts across the lane. Now it's Reed. Whoops, Reed at about a five-footer. He shot at three feet. Yeah. <laughs> had the alligator arms on that shot. Garland roars in the hole and lays it in, and the Cavaliers are back within four. Mitchell cautiously works on Council, splits another double. There's Allen! Oh, Allen with a vicious dunk! Garland reaches baseline, double clutches and scores. Boy, that was a pretty move as Garland switched to the left hand around. Cavaliers starting five is back on the floor as Garland pedals away from Maxi, gives to Mitchell. Mitchell down the lane, deals to Allen. Allen floats it up and in over Bamba and trims the sixer lead to 106. Team four run. Garland steps back. They're going to count the basket. Max got mine pretty easily. There wasn't a lot of contact as Garland in the basket lays it in. Buddy's picked up his fifth foul. He's saying, how in the world did that happen as we have a timeout on the floor and tap it back to Garland. 100 seconds remain. Garland in toward Oubre. Stutter steps, looks for Allen. Allen has to come down with it. He lays it in. Sixers 117, Cavs 110. Allen has 24 points. Spruce over to Garland. Garland nails a three. Tell you what, if Oubre misses that shot, that's a disaster.